Thank you. You are welcome. Who's that? Welcome. Nobody's welcome. the author. We are about to embark on a great voyage. It is customary to make a little speech on the first day. It does no harm. Authors like it. You want to know what parts you are to receive? All will be settled as we go. I'll do it. Now, listen to me, you dregs. Actors are ten a penny. And I, Hugh Fenneman, hold your nuts in my hand. Huzzah! The Abrams men are returned to the house! Who is this? Silence, you jock! I am Hieronimo. I am Tamberley. I am Faustus. I am Barabbas, the Jew of Malta. Oh, yes, Master Will. I am Henry the Sixth. What is the play, and what is my part? Uh, one moment, sir. Who are you? I'm, um... I'm the money. Then you may remain, so long as you remain silent. Pay attention. You will see how genius creates a legend. Thank you, sir. We are in desperate want of a Mercutio, Ned. A young nobleman of Verona. Mm -hmm. And the title of this piece? Mercutio. Is it? I will play him. Mr. Phillips, welcome. George Bryant, James Armitage. <laughs> so, my pretty one. Oh, are you ready to fall in love again? I am, Master Shakespeare. Your voice. Have they dropped? <laughs> no, no. A touch of cold only. Master Henslow, you have your actors, except Thomas Kent. <laughs> I, uh, I saw his tambourine, you know. That's wonderful. Yes, I saw it. Of course, it's mighty writing. There's no one like Marlowe. And from my lips, oh, trespass sweetly urged, give me my sin again. Yes, yes, uh, not quite right. It is more, let me, then have my lips the sin that they have took. Sin from my lips, oh, trespass sweetly urged, give me my sin again. You kiss by the book. 